Welcome back to Atlanteon, the prologue. We are here tonight with Beishe, the Thrike Green Warlock, played by Odin, Nilla, the Sea People Bard Cleric, played by Aaron, and Grey, Tabaxi Ranger and Warlock, played by Joe. Would you each take a minute to describe your characters, please? Uh, let's start with My Beishe. first? We'll start oh. with Beishe. Oh, uh, all right. It's like alphabetical order? Sure. Oh, okay, great. All right. Um, Beishe is a Thrycreen warlock uh, from the uh, the Dark Hive. Uh, he's very uh, very proper uh, and is very noble. Uh, male, uh, amber orange eyes, no hair at all because he's an insect. Um, he's seven feet tall, but on the contrary, he weighs eighty. He weighs eighty pounds. He's a very offensive character, offensive character. Um, with Almost no defensive spells apart from Wall of Fire. Um, and um, his favorite spell is Blight. Woohoo. And my favorite spell is Blight. Excellent. Uh, Nilla, would you take a moment to describe? Uh, to Aaron, would you take a moment to describe Nilla, please? Um, well, Nilla is currently, because this can change, a, um, a bunny person. <laughs> and uh with a little bit of a golden sheen to the fur looking real cute um little tiara cute dress um nice shoes she's ready for the day would rather talk than do anything else and she's got she's here with her friend gray taxi excellent joe would you take a moment to describe gray please Gray. I am a Tabaxi Ranger. Um, I am a monster hunter um, by trade. And I'm here with Nilla, who graciously stayed behind um, to help me um, rehabilitate my master. I'm large but young. Um, so I'm almost seven feet tall, weigh over 200 pounds, but I'm in my early 20s. Excellent. Now that we are acquainted with all of the with all the players, uh, they are currently at, at they are currently uh, in the in the airship uh, next to the that which is parked outside the Palace of Hearts Desire, uh, Gray's master where Gray's master is uh, is uh, uh, you were you had hustled hustled him out out here with you into the uh, into the airship as well, correct? Um, yeah, we're all in the airship together. Yeah. Great. Uh, and, uh, and you were just about to take off, just about to take off for, uh, where, where were you, where were you about to head? Um, well, we were, we were catching the airship off the tower to go back to the Palace of Heart's Desire. Mm -hmm. Yep. Um, that's right. And we yeah, were greeted by our, we were greeted by our, um, host. Rex, correct. You yeah, had, you who had just murdered someone. You hadn't made it back to the made it back to the palace yet. No, um, we were just on the airship, um, and Zablina had been a murder in, I think. Yes. Asking us about whether or not we're loyal. Yes. Zablina, lo Zablina's looking at looking at at the at the at the three of you with with a with a craziest look in with the craziest look in her eyes, and uh, and and. Uh, then she she seems to stop and uh, take take a breath, looks around a little confusedly for a moment, and says, "Oh dear, uh, where are we?" You are in an airship, not at the palace. Oh um, dear, yes. We we were we were exploring. While the master is recuperating. Yes, of course. I, of course, we should go back to the palace. Where is the Where is the conductor? The she she turns and and her and her foot brushes. She looks down. Oh. Oh my. And she and she is and she is just looking. As you look at her, her her hands are her hands are stained with blood. And uh, and and as is her 
as is her, her the front of her of her uh, of her beautiful dress. Um, and she's just, not so beautiful now. She's da- she's dazed and uh, and uh, and and doesn't and doesn't appear to doesn't appear to under to really understand what's going on. I I believe you just retired our um, conductor. Oh dear. Oh no. Oh, I'm, I'm so sorry. This is, oh no. And she's uh, and she's uh, and and she she appears to be uh, to be overcome and <laughs> and uh, and and as she sits there, sits there worrying, she begins to go transparent, and fades away. <sighs> so, uh, just, uh, just poof. Yeah. Cool. Love like it. A, like a like a nineteen like a nineteen sixties uh like a nineteen sixties uh you know I dream of Je- I dream of genie she just she just slowly fades away. No poof. Alrighty no then. Just okay. Boom. Maybe she's possessed by something. That's um, somehow worse. Exactly what I said. Mind control. She was possessed, and um, what summoned her away? Embarrassment? I don't know. <laughs> Does anybody know how to fly an airship? Probably not. I Can I we... could um Oh yeah, you kind of flew the the airship you when a it was a little bit, but it was I'm not the most accurate flyer as we found. Well, I you're better get than... us going. <laughs> okay. Well, we should pick up your master and get out of here. We have a get yes. out of jail free uh key, right? We have yes. a from you we, do, we do we do okay. um well speaking of which you're still Bishop, here get in the left. airship and where'd you come from i thought you left um it's a it's a long story okay um i'll tell I'll, I'll i'll tell you i'll tell you later uh but right now as you said we gotta get out of here all right so um i'm gonna jump in the conductor seat after i check um Clapper Claw's body for any items. Uh, Anything he has on him. You know, I'm not sure what he has. And then Classic. look at the wound and see if I can discern if it was just like a knife or something or something like a spell or something so I can kind of get an idea of what she may have done Roll an investigation. as we came up. Investigation. Eighteen. Eight. With an eighteen, you are able. You are able to discern. It looks like it. It. It's a a lot. It's a skinny, deep puncture wound, okay. and there's there's four of them right next right next to each other. Ooh. It looks like she just literally took her fingers through her nails. Touch. Yes. Okay. Not not just her nails, but like su- sunk down like to her hand. Like oh wow. They're uh, they're several inches deep each. Of them. But he's so little. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. So she's she got, got super angry. She's uh, gone to crazy town. Yeah, because or she's possessed. Because Clapperclaw was one of the was one of the more loyal ones to her, if you recall. And more nervously, is if she's been possessed. As powerful as she is, what is able to possess her so easily? Yeah. Well, I mean, we could also like think about the weirdness. She's an adopted daughter of Baba Yaga's, and like all them, them ladies had some kind of problem. Yeah. With with something mystical. So I mean, this could just be her problem. Classic hag business. Hopefully, yeah. Hags, man, what you gonna do? Uh, yeah. So, yeah, she she lit she literally uh she literally like pull like pulled a pulled a large chunk of his internal stuffing out as well. Because if you recall, Clapper Claws is scared. Oh my god. Um so yeah, he's uh 
he's pretty uh dead. Yeah, he's pretty he's pretty dead. Um but sure. he but he's the only things that he really has are the are his, you know, are you know, the pieces that made him up. So like there's a big lobster uh-huh. claw and there's a pumpkin um pair of boots. We should probably nothing, just bury him. Uh could I nothing use my... that would help me like map or anything to help me fly the ship, give me advantage on that or anything like that. Nothing. Nothing on him, no. Okay. Could Should I we use... bury him before we go out back to the palace instead of taking his body with us, you guys? Seems respectful. I mean, could I use my uh unicorn uh chitin amalgam to or is that or can I only use the unicorn horn when they're still alive? Hmm. Good question. Well, he is a construct, so if you put him back together, you could technically reanimate him. Does anyone know how to build things? I've heard of it. <laughs> okay. I break things. I don't put them back together. Well, all we can do is try, right? It can't. He can't yep. be any worse off than he is. Oh, I shouldn't have said that. But let's try. So you take so so uh so Beche produces his uh the you you've you've seen his his weapon before, which is basically like a finger giant uh, giant uh, chunk of uh, giant chunk of carapace. Well, now it the unicorn horn that had been broken, and and more or less, and that everyone was going to discard is he kept, and he has now fu- he's now fused and built it onto his onto his height. So so he has uh, he has augmented his uh, his uh, uh, pack weapon. Um, so now na- so so he hold he holds it up, and uh, and. Uh, the unicorn horn has been filled in with a kind of silvery, with a kind of sil- some sort of silvery, uh, bright metal, um, and basically, basically the unicorn horn was repaired and then mounted onto the, uh, and then fused together with the with the the kite. So he holds it, he holds it up, and it and it and it begins glowing with glowing with a, uh, with a uh, a blue light. He ho- and and uh, he holds it. O- he holds it over Clapperclaw, and uh, and the, and the power begin and the the unic- the power of the the glow from the unicorn horn begins to uh, spread across Clapperclaw, and uh, and and uh, you, you take a se- you take a second to uh, to to sew up the sew up the holes uh, where where uh, where, she, where she had where she had uh, had ripped the stuffing out of it. Um, and, uh, and he begins, he begins to, to shake a little bit like, oh, that was really, uh, that was really unfortunate. Oh, what happened? Where did she go? Oh, well, that was what we were going to ask you. What happened? Sabrina? She, she came, she came in while, while you were out. Uh, and she said that I was off my route because I was waiting for you. And, and, uh, and. She said that I was not that was not doing my job and that I was disloyal and that I was bad. Okay, I don't think you're bad. Nah, you, no, you're good. You're 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 you, okay, Clap for Claw. I okay. think something's wrong, and it is not our job to fix it. I don't think. That's I think facts. we should get out of here. I've never, exactly. I've never seen her like that before. She's never been like that ever. Oh, yeah. And Beisha, um, you've been gone for such a short time, and you've come back with so many more surprises. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm full of them. Cool. Yeah, well, well, it, it has been, it, it has been a couple months since, since, uh, since you've been gone. So, uh, hey, good to see you. <laughs> yeah, good to see you too. Well, I guess, uh, whew. Boy, I'm gonna go get a drink. He he toddles and he starts walking up towards the pilot's compartment. Can constructs drink? Sure, why not? 
Okay. They're gonna they can. Watch one do it. Um, I, I look, um, I want to check around and see if I can see where the bunny tracks disappeared to, or do they end at the ship? Like, is there any, no, they were far, far out. We had to come to the ship. The bunny tracks are, yeah, the bunny tracks were far out. away and your mic is out again. Nope. It's out. Oh, uh, Can you uh, hear me? Okay. Yes, there you are. Oh, I can um, hear you now. So we we from our vantage point at the airship, I'm just gonna as we're flying away, I want to keep looking and see if I can figure out did the bunnies go up in a puff of smoke or potentially survived. But I'm uh, not gonna go investigate. I want to fly out of here. Uh the but the the but uh, the bunnies appear to have uh appear to the the tracks just stopped. Disappeared. Okay. Yeah. yeah. But she, the, she uh, did something. Well. The ground looks, the ground looks somewhat disturbed. Okay. Probably got teleported out by her. All right. So I'm going to take controls and try to get. Oh no! Wait. Clapperclaw's alive. So I'm just going to stand behind Clapperclaw and watch very closely what he does, and try to ascertain what's the best way to fly as he's flying us back. Clapperclaw. Clapperclaw. When you go up back up back up to the pilot's compartment, he has a yeah he has a, a he has a can of a can of oil that he's going. Huh. Wow. <laughs> Everyone well, has their own way to cope. <laughs> that's the weirdest well, we thing that's we... ever happened to me, man. You Don't okay, dude? As, as as weird, I. Unpleasant. I well, guess. I mean, I mean, holy, and the, and the, and the, and then the, and the, and the ah. You're well, delightful. You're, you're with us now, though, so that's all that matters. I suppose. I suppose you. You need me to to run the bus, huh? Okay. Uh, yeah. um, and he starts. Then he then he starts. Uh, he starts fire. He starts firing up the firing up the the heater for the heater for the for the hot air. Um. And uh and and you and you see that and you see that there's a a pre flight checklist that hangs that hangs on the wall that he's uh, that that uh that he's completely ignoring. Um. And uh, and uh, he uh, and he, he pulls up a he pull he pulls up a, a, a rope next to, next to him, um, and you feel and you feel the whole uh, you feel the whole uh, airship you know begin rocking like it's like it's beginning to like it's beginning to rise, uh, and uh, and then he and then he uh, he then he begins uh, uh, pedaling. There's a little, uh, there's there's a little, little stationary, uh, there's a little stationary bike, bike at the bottom of it. At the bottom of it. Aww. Cool. cool. Um, How would a differently sized person do that? You just kind of. Uh, kind of, yeah. Um, considering that, considering that he's uh, that he's not really that big. He's um, small, I think. Yeah, small he's size. Small. Yeah, he's about he's a uh, he's roughly dwarf size, if I remember. Oh, oh, so. I I as far as I knew, he was small size. Yeah. 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 So yeah. uh, so yeah, so he's so and then he's got he's got a little he's got a little stick. You're not even sure how he how he's seeing to drive because you know he's kind of like all laid back and you know and the windows up here, so so he's just kind of and he starts uh and. Starts pedaling and the and the airship begins moving. Um, well, Beche, now that we're on the way, um, how did you get here and why are you here? Okay, so first of all, as as I got home, uh, old mother told me to uh, 
that uh, the entire world is about in six years time is about to go into a great decline, which means doomsday is coming. Um, so then she told me to go around to a bunch of civilizations and tell everyone and meet up with all of the party's members, right? We meet up with all of you guys and I guess Paladin and, um, yeah, and I, yeah, and I guess Paladin too. Um, yeah, meet up with them because, uh, to help me with this endeavor. Um, I went to city of, I went to the city of glass, told them, um, it wasn't very friendly. They weren't very friendly to me. It broke my heart. Um, but uh yeah, then uh they were um I pulled out the the knives that you gave me, Gray, and um it 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 po- it didn't point in a direction, it pointed outward and inward at the same time. So I I felt this was kind of cryptic, so I called mother and um I asked her what it meant and she said uh that you guys were on a different plane of existence. So I'm like, oh, okay. Um, and now, and then I just pulled the half moon card in my back pocket and then I just, um, wish to be with you guys again. So, um, that's how I'm here now. Oh, well, I, it's awesome. You burned your wish, but um, yeah. Do we mean the world is ending? Like, do we, do we need um, to find a new world? I mean, you're kind of bringing a lot of heavy news here. (laughs) Yeah, I know. Um, it's, it said a great decline and I was reading up about it in, in, uh, the history uh of my hive and the time before like there this has happened 12 times before and this is the 13th um so the, the time before this one it was a great ice age the time before that one it was a big drought the time before that it was volcanoes exploding the time before that fire rocks were raining down and this time it hasn't showed anything yet but on um, the charts of of like in the great conclave of the city of glass, as I said, um, they were saying like something was draining from like underground. So I saw that too. So something is definitely happening. Something? Like under uh, water? something some no, not water because none of the oceans are drying up, but like some of the something is being sucked out of the ground. So oh, kind of weird. Well, huh? I can see why people didn't exactly like your tidings because you were just like. Bad stuff's gonna happen. I have yeah. no solution and don't know how, but hey. Yeah, hi. facts. Yeah, yeah. Nice to meet you. Um yeah. what was that name? Doom, y'all. Doom. And then then you just came to us. So like you had to tell them, oh, and by the way, I have to go. Um yeah. so they were ecstatic about that also. hmm Well, I mean, I just feel like if you know the world's gonna be ruined, you should go ahead and try and save it if you can. Uh, that's we what I'm trying. That's what I'm trying to do. I mean, Mother Queen didn't tell me to save the world. She just told me to tell everyone it was going to end. So, Yeah, that's a very depressing way to deal with the end of the world. Mm-hmm. Did she give you instructions on what to do once you found us? Because um, oh, we're here. <laughs> I, yeah, no. Uh, she just told me to, like, get you guys, like, get you guys back together. And then you guys are going to help me with this quest thing. All right, all right. Um, I'm in it to win well, it. First things first, we need to get out of this place. Cause Agreed. Is... I mean, I'd like to help her. I really would, but I'd also like not to be dead. Yeah. So, yeah. Being dead would kind of suck. But I mean, Pepper, it looks like you're going to get out of the It sure does. <laughs> do you want to come with us or do you want to stay here? I mean, she just deaded you. So it's possible she'll do it again. Upper claw. Uh, well, um, I'm not sure where else I can go because I'm kind of kind of worried about going anywhere else. You know, because what if she comes and finds me and you know and kills me and puts me back running running the bus again? Uh, that she's is true. she's That's not gonna do that. How do you know that? Yeah, I don't know. Trying, <laughs> I, I wish I whisper. I whisper in I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to comfort him. Oh, well, uh, uh, we're 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 here now. Um, and the and he begins he begins uh begins messing with the with the rope next to him, lowering what looking like he's lowering something down. 
um, and uh, and and he 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 stops he stops pedaling, um, and uh, and uh, and and is uh, is pu and pulls a uh, and pulls a uh, a handle down, uh, next next to him, and you and you hear a coming from uh, from far from far up from far above. Um, okay, so. I try to imitate the sound. Hey, that's pretty good. <laughs> Uh, and uh, and you you feel you feel a slight you feel a slight bump as uh, as a, as, a, as the the airship settles to the ground. He says, "Palace of Heart's Desire, uh, watch your step." And uh, thank you. And uh, and opens up. Thanks for coming. See you the next time. Thanks if for there, bringing us. If there will Sorry. be, a I stand under my breath. Oh. If there even will be a next uh, time. Before I leave. I'm gonna use, um, I guess mending would be it, or pressing. If there's uh blood and stuff, uh -huh. I want to make sure to clean that up on my way out. Just using okay. mending or pressing. Is it just a vegetation? Uh, will do it. Yeah, pressing vegetation. Go ahead and clean up. There you go. Yep. As we leave. So, uh, so you set, so you set the, you set the mop and uh, the mop and uh, and scrub brush working. As you as you leave, uh, and uh, and you step in and you step into the pal into the palace of hearts desire. Um, it is well. That was interesting. Let's get your master because this is yes. We crazy. have to get out of here. It is time to. I know. Go. I I say to both of you. I I know. Like we need to get out of here, but how do we get out of here? Oh, we've got a way. Don't worry. That's not yes. cryptic at all. <laughs> yeah, we just need to get um we need to get the master. Okay. And then um once we have our party together and ooh, I need provisions. I gave them all away. Yes. Yeah. I have some. Yeah. We should go down to the kitchens or something and You guys like honey? You you always peddling honey. Do you guys eat anything else? No. Honey? Not really. And chopped up parts from things we kill. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. What? You don't All do right. that? No, I just chop up the things. I don't eat them. Okay. So I'm looking for a midpoint between the kitchens, like where we'd get provisions, and um, getting a Gray's Master out. So I... somewhere that has a little bit of privacy. We've been in the palace for however long. Has a little bit of privacy um, where they can wait while I get, you know, provisions and stuff for us. And well, I'm gonna try uh, to break camp with Beche, if 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 we can split and let her get the provisions, and I'm gonna use him to get the master, and we're gonna take him for a walk to get him some exercise. Okay. And try to meet her like so, like wherever the provision spot is, I want to run up forward. And then try to come back so we can meet her away from all the people that we're caring for him. Because if we try to more than take him for a walk, I think it'll alert people too much. Are we trying to run from her or are we trying to um, her? We're just trying to get out of this building before okay. she loses her mind again. All right. And I figure if, if I use you, we could kind of carry him one. You know, you got one side, I got the other. And kind of just say we're getting him some exercise. Kind of yeah. like when you know walk someone down the hall in the, in the hospital yeah sure yeah i mean it's day 40 that, sounds good where are we going to meet um, all right so we we know we... the palace pretty well where would be a good spot Meg? uh probably the, probably the ma master probably your your master's master's chamber because you still need to get get your, did you pack all of your stuff like you're ready to go you just did you grab your traveling pack out of your room or was your stuff unpacked? My stuff's unpacked. Yeah, so you're so you're gonna need you're gonna need some you're gonna need definitely need some time to pack. All uh, right, yeah. So then let's meet up. Let's meet up where the master is. Then my so stuff let's, is always let's, packed. Let's 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 not split up. If you let's okay. stick together then. That's totally provisions first. Provisions first. All right. Okay. Uh, so you so you go to the you go to the kitchens, and. Uh, 
and you and you see the you see the 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 kitchen staff uh the kitchen staff are 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 in are in there cooking um everyone roll a perception check for me perception let's see here it could also be no. insight or religion oh religion oh okay i'll roll religion then i'm rolling this again <laughs> I roll a 20. <laughs> I'm rolling it again. 22. I, this, is my, this is my dice. I'm rolling it again. This is getting ridiculous. Perception, perception. All right. Well, I rolled an 18. That's... Okay. 22. So, okay, so... Unnatural 20. So, good. Uh, all, three, all three of you are in there, and, you know, you're, and your, your senses are a little heightened. The kitchen staff is, seems to be working as normal, but there's one person... Uh, there's, there's one, per, one person... A uh, a red cat who's working off by off by themselves seems to be, you know, ha have a have a, a a little bit of a uh, there some there's something off about him. He's he's currently he's he's apparent apparent he appears to be uh mixing something in, into a into uh into some steak pat or some a, a large tureen of something. I walk over to him and I say, "Hey, what you making?" He looks. He looks up. He looks up at up at up at you suddenly, uh, and his, and his eye, his eye. The, there's a a glowing red ring around his uh around his irises briefly that flashes and then then dis, then disappears. And he says, "Nothing, nothing." And he he puts the stopper back in back in the bot back in the bottle and and uh and uh, begins uh. Begins backing away, starts well, heading heading towards the heading towards the uh the door over here. I'm just gonna uh uh go put this back in the ba back in. Oh no, the I don't think so. There. I I I, I follow I have followed myself. Well, I'll nothing nothing smells pretty nice. So can I see that nothing that you're holding? Uh uh uh. His 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 eyes flashing. His eyes fla flash and seem to almost seem to bur burst into flame as as he as he looks as he. As he looks at the three of you and says, "You will never have it. I will never give it to you." And he br and he drinks it all. He drinks it all down. You see his throat begins to glow red, and uh, uh -oh. and he begins. <laughs> he almost seems to burn from the from the inside out, and you see and you see momentarily, uh, seems to climb out of the burning, uh, uh. is a small winged creature um it's uh it's it's kind of like it's uh ray roll me a roll me a uh a knowledge or arcana check because you would have i think you would have the best chance of knowing what this is everyone can roll can roll if they want if they want to um but it's about uh, it's about twelve inches tall, uh, long and long and thin. Looks like, appears to be made of uh, of either fire or lava of some kind, um, and has little bat wings. I rolled a one. Nineteen total. Okay. I think your mic's out, Joe. Okay, with a nat one, Beche definitely does not know. Eighteen. Excellent. Uh, so, uh, the, both uh, both Nilla and Gray have read about have read about these before. They it is a fire method. It is a type of lesser demon, and it 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 looks like it snarls and then di then disappears and leaves like a little burning ring, uh, there uh, there on the guy's chest where he where he where uh. Uh, where he disappeared from. Nobody eat this cake. Check, please. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Do not eat that cake. It's very bad for you. Yeah. Too the, many carbs. The other, did, uh... did everybody else see the demon climb out of the red cap's body? We're not, I'm not going insane by myself, right? No, no, I, I, I'm going insane with you. Oh, good. What, what I crawled out of the? It was a demon. What crawled out of the red cap? Sorry, I wasn't really paying attention. 
No, I rolled a nat. I rolled a nat one, so I'm saying this it, as it, like my character. It, it's it's a little mini demon. Um, Shay was some, looking, some... was too busy looking inside the cake and didn't see the. L- little mini demon came out of him, so um, we have some major possessions going on. Okay. Ugh. Probably fine. Are we going to have to stay here and fix this? <laughs> no. No. <sighs> no. No, no, no. no, 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 no we don't we and we don't have, to, don't have to feel bad about it because Beishe told us that the whole world's going to end if we don't leave soon. So Yeah, 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 yeah. World, Prismere, world, Prismere, eh. I mean, can't they be related? They are. So if we don't save the world, Prismere dies. And then once we save the world with everyone, we can come back and visit the queen. Yeah. You're giving me a real hard sell there. But I guess I'll go along. <laughs> so you're able to collect, All right. you're able to collect some, some food pretty quickly. And you skedaddle, and you skedaddle back to uh, skedaddle back, up, back upstairs to the master chamber uh, after packing your things. Uh, well, all- I want to be really careful about what provisions we grab, as in, if it's something being freshly prepared now, F that. We're not taking it. <laughs> Who knows how many demons are in here? I don't care. You're talking about hard cheeses. We're talking about hard tack. We're talking about the kind of stuff that's, you know, was made a while ago and is in a storage oh, room oh. somewhere. Non-perishable oh. food items. I grabbed my Basically. little campestry. Uh-huh. And I have him look around and make sure we pick the non-tainted food. Since he's a little mushroom, he's going to have a good way to pick out stuff for us too. He absolutely hey. does. He he goes. He begins. He begins roaming around, roaming around the kitchen, and he's and he's tossing out. He's tossing out. Uh, he he finds uh, he finds uh, barrels. Uh, he finds a barrel of pickles that he that he says this is what that he, he that he puts out. Then he. He goes next to it and sn- sniffs it. And he's like, "Oh," and he and and uh, and it's and it's marked uh, it, and it's marked as uh, as ale. Okay, uh, no ale. Got it. Um, he goes down. He and he begin he begins sorting and he fi- he finds a bunch of fresh greens and stuff like that, um, and uh, and some cured meat, uh, and is able to put together about uh about seven days of rations for for each for each of. He makes a set. For, he makes a set for Beche as well, um, but uh, he doesn't realize that Beche can't and won't eat it. But, uh, can't what? That you can't and won't eat it. Yeah. Eat the, the but it's food. but he's a nice little guy. Yes. So I pick him up, toss him up there, and I grab the food and let's haul. Yeah, let's go. Agreed. <sighs> Uh, yeah, the, and the the, kit, the kitchen staff just kind of just kind of you know, barely barely acknowledges you, but you notice as they you notice as they're uh, as, as as you're leaving, they're like, hey, "Where'd Red go?" Oh, you didn't see that? Oh, you guys, he's he in a better place now. Not one. He of turned them into a fire. Not one of them yeah. thought. Not one of them thought. Not oh, um. You don't want to use his cake batter, and he turned into a demon really quickly. I don't know why. They yeah, look, they look they look puzzled. It yeah. probably the, the the cake batter is bad. You don't want to use it. He was putting something in it, and we don't know what. So, what well, and what and one of them one of them starts walking over to invest to invest to investigate. Are you going to stand there and watch them as they start investigating, or? Um, well, I mean, I'm waiting mean, to you, see if like a you, hand comes yeah. out of the batter and grabs them or something, you know. Yeah. What do you mean by investigating? Kind of like day. tasting it? Or are they gonna no, taste he's, it? No, he's, he's looking. He's looking at it and he's hold. He's, he's hold. He's like poking at it, poking at it, like trying to see if there's digging it, digging into it with a with a big wooden spoon to try to you know, see if there's something in it, like what did he put in it? I don't know, but he poured something in it and then. He drank something, and then a demon. He was on fire, and a demon burst out of his out of his body. So, I don't know what to tell you. It got really weird really quickly. Really, but it's, it's, I saw it. Gray saw it, and Beche saw it. So, oh yeah. But all but all there's left is you know this this burnt is this ring on the floor. Yep. Mm-hmm. 
Oh my it's God. probably it's probably a summoner's circle. You might not want to touch it. Yeah. He, he he realizes he's he realizes he's standing in it, and he's like, oh. Ooh. Back he back backs up and uh, uh backs up carefully and tiptoes out of it, like a uh, tries to seem like he's trying to wipe it off of his feet. Hmm. Okay, let's move on. Yeah, let's go get Gray's master. Although, what we're going to do with him, maybe I should try ascending, you know? Maybe I could contact him. His mind might be somewhere else. Definitely may work. You enter the the room, and Gray's master is sitting up. What? (gasps) He's sitting sitting up? He's sitting up, and he's sitting up and and looking around. You ca- you come All righty then. He looks. He looks up at you and says, says "Gray, we must yes. go." Yes. I I I definitely agree with that. He he uh, he he se- he steps out. He, he climbs. He climbs out of the bed and says, "But where are my clothes?" Hey, um, wait a minute. You didn't have wait, any. Wait. Look. Hey, one second, one second. You're looking really good. Hi, we haven't met. Hello. I'm Nilla. Good to meet you, Nilla. Oh, yeah, me. Hey, you should ask him something only your master would know. True. Let's make sure he's the real one. The real one? What has happened? You should ask him something only your master would know, Gray. Master, Great. two questions. Where did you keep the book in the sanctuary? And what was the last thing we were doing before you saw me again? The book was, lo- the book was located under the sanctuary. It was inside a magic was inside a magic fountain kept okay kept safe and the last thing that the, the last thing that i remember before before see, before seeing you was all right uh, we are unpaused uh and he said that and the uh and, and he says the last the, the last time i saw you you were following my order to my order to run before I did ba- before I did battle with him. But how then did I come to be here? I um I got a, a wish and I I wished you back. Oh, Gray. You spent a wish on me. I feel so flattered. So now we need to get out of here. Yes, indeed. Where is, and um, where is I dig through whatever clothing, extra clothing I may have, would just be undergarments and try to throw it to him. Yeah, he's basically he's basically just like you in a, in a, a long uh, in a long night shirt more or less. He, ta- he, oh. he takes it and says, "We're we're pr- Prismir, um, we're guests of Zablina. Zablina. I do not know this. That's just as well. How many we? Really- she- how many we Jeez. return to the sanctuary? Sorry, go ahead. How many return to the sanctuary? Yes. There's just us. How may we return to the sanctuary? Oh, oh how may we return to the sanctuary? Uh, I'm hoping our friend here, Nilla, she does a lot of traveling and she's very worldly and may have a way to get us passage out of here. Um, with a an item that we have procured and i don't say anything else and i just grab our stuff and i'm thinking we need a hall butt out to will any door do you think the what will any door do i'm 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 thinking yeah like one of the out the the outer doors like we're running it doesn't matter if as long as it has a keyhole. We'll try oh, that. Oh, I didn't think about that. Yeah, yeah. The closet. You can even I use the door that. to this room. The, the door to this room has a has has a, a, a keyhole. All right, let's try it. What the hell? 
So I make sure that my sword is ready as she <laughs> goes to <laughs> try the key. Okay. This key is is from where? In the witch light. It's a she she gave us a key to get to the witch light. This is the key that we got acquired, right? You uh -huh. Oh, yeah. the, the one that you got off of uh, the one that you got. Not the really secreted. special one that I've got secreted. No, you're, she's talking Diana. about the, the key that got us to the wish light. Well, she mirrors? made a key to get us to the wish light, basically. Yeah. It's what? What, goes, what? We we have a key that key? goes to the wish light. Okay. Like the witch light? What's carnival. the wish light? Yeah, oh, wherever carnival. it might be. Okay, yeah. I don't know what that is. It's 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 a fun carnival place that we are royalty at, so it's safe. Okay. Well. Cool. So you we're hoping. So you you so you put the you put the key in the key in the door and 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 turn and turn it, uh and and the and and the, the and the door seems seems to rattle briefly. And then you and then you feel uh you feel. You know, coming from coming from the the crack under the under the door, uh, you you uh you feel uh you feel a a a bit of warm air. Hmm. I'll open it up and take the key. You open you open the, the door you open the door up, and and uh, it leads in, it leads into what looks like uh what what looks like some sort an uh, an empty uh empty box car a box car yeah the inside of yes empty box car. yes i say let's go all right and... make sure you okay the let's take, yeah. take what it looks like an empty box car make sure you take the key with you yes oh. out the door okay. so we grab the key from inside the door you know pull it out of the door and then shut the door behind us yes you do so and you shut the door behind you, and and uh, it it is very warm here. Um, it is, uh, it's, it's a, uh, it's a nice, uh, it's a nice autumn day. Um, and and I look, I peer outside. out the. Is there like windows of the box car that I can peer out and look? Uh, there, there's not, there's not windows, but there, but there are some, there are some spaces and you know some. Some uh, cracks between planks that you can peer out of. Does it remind me of the cars that the witch like caravan? It sure does. Okay, so I peer out one of the cracks and see if I can see anything that looks familiar. Are we moving? Are we stationary? Okay, shut up. You are actually. You, it actually looks like the exact same forest that you were in before. Oh, I don't like that forest. It's like it. Ha like uh, it's like the the carnival hasn't moved since the last huh. time. Well, we should check on uh, Star, the displacer, the displacer, um, and see that she's got back to her mom. Wait, Nilla, mm -hmm. it, 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 it seems like it hasn't moved. It should have already moved. Yes, but remember how time is weird? I'm going to do, so do something crazy. I'm going to grab the stone. And try to contact the kinku. Okay. And you say, "Hey, hey, buddy." Oh, well, he's not here. Well, I just want to see if he answers. And is he still intact? He he does answer. He does answer, and he he says, "Hello." Yes. Um, is everything okay? How you been doing? Uh, uh everything's everything's great since uh since Sabrina has been back back. Oh, okay. That's awesome. Are you are sure Zablina hasn't been acting, you know, um, out of character? Uh, uh, well, you know, I don't see her every day, but you know, I, 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 I try to. I, I, but uh, I, I've been, I've just been uh, doing my um, my my mail route every day, and you know, in the in 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 the far the far north. Okay, so you're just hanging out in Prismere, just hanging, doing your oh, thing? Yeah, yeah, I'm back oh, home. Wow. I've got got my old job back. It's great. Ah. Oh, okay, I just want to check. Well, thanks for talking to me. Hey, how are you? I, oh, it's we're, it's, we're it's been a while. Yeah, yeah, it's been a long while. We're just, just kind of hanging out, doing some things, you know, just kind of enjoying, looking looking for good jobs. Ah, great. Well, good luck. Right, thanks. Yep. 
I, w- I whisper to uh, Gray, is he always like this? Yes, he's he's always a little weird, but he was a little more off this time. Um, so I know he's not dead, so that's good. Now we just got to figure out what's going on with the witch light. And you okay. weren't you weren't here before. Nope. I okay. have no idea where we are. So mm. I'm a queen I'm, here. I'm going to ask nice. if, it, if it's okay with you. And I look at my master and say, master, look and hang out with Beishe. If anything happens, you two are together if we have to break away. Got it. I will protect it. I will protect him with it, with every fiber of my being. Here. Oh, oh, okay, sir. And then um, I, I, I jump out of the back of it and see what I see. Uh, so you you slide you slide the door you slide the door open and the carnival it, the carnival is in full swing. Um, there's lot there's lots of uh, lots of elven children uh, running around running around and enjoying the carnival. Uh, their parents are are walking around with, walking around with them as well. On I let Neil Nilla um, lead us to. Was it lost things? Yes. Am I remembering correctly? Lost things to check on the yep. displacer beast. Yep. Excellent. You go to lost. Th- you go to lost things, and uh, and the and the displacer beast is playing is playing happily with her kitten. Oh yay! And she looks up. She looks up and, and and says, and says, "Yes. Did you have you lost something? Well, just a no. Mo- just a moment, dear. I'll feed you in a minute." We we just wanted to check and see that Star was back. We 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 came from um, Prismere, where oh, she was. Yes, you sent you you sent her back. Thank you so much. I can't I I can't I can't express I can't express my. Uh, I can't express my my uh my appreciation and my and and my gratitude and uh she and she's so happy that literally her her image is just yeah buzzing out, buzzing <laughs> out all over all over well, the place. You have us to thank and the traveler too. I think traveler always looks after lost children. The traveler the traveler will will always be welcome will always be welcome here. Thank you. Thank the tra- thank the traveler. Praise to the traveler. Who's a traveler? Have you been Have you been at this location for a while? Does it seem? Uh, yes, it seems like we've been like we've been parked here, like we've been parked here for 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 some time. When When is the carnival going to be over, and you guys are going to move to the next? Do they Have they notified the staff yet? Uh, we're supposed to be moving on tomorrow, from what they said, from what I've heard. Pulling up stakes tonight. <laughs> Came back just in time. Yes, yes, we did. Well, here's hoping that ever here's hoping that all your deeds are as are as timely. Where where to next, Nilla? What do you think? Hmm. I'm not sure. Maybe out. Check in with Mr. Witch and Mr. Light. Oh, and by the way, that thing I told you about the alternate god, you know that's a secret, right? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what you're talking about either. Oh, you're not with us. You're with the master. Oh, my bad. Yeah, yeah. I don't know what you're talking about. Never will. So, Beche, you and the you and, you and the master are are staying in the box car. The plan is keep them together, and if they're found, they're just people. Because I didn't want them in case something followed us. I want them to at least be able to break camp. Right. Uh. So. So the the master the master look, looks 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 up at you, up at you Beche, and he and he and he says Gray told us to stay put for the evening. What did you say? Gray told us to stay put for the evening. Yeah. You expect we're just gonna to remain here. Yep, we're just gonna stay here for a little while. I'm quite hungry and I smell food. Come, let's go. And he begins, uh and he, uh. he uh and he steps out he then he steps out. He hops that hops down out of the out of the box car. Um, you, you sure? I'm I'm pretty sure Gray told us to stay like stay put right here. He told you to stay with me. Come, it's true. Let us get, let us get some food. Technically, <sighs> fine. That's his style. I can't eat anything else but but what I have here. But okay, sure, I'll follow you. I guess. Well, I feel like I haven't eaten 
in years. And yeah, I don't think you have. He he and he hop, he hops over to uh he hops over to a food a food kiosk right ne- right next door and he or and uh and he just hop, he hops up and grabs a and grabs a turkey leg and and begins ch- begins chowing down. Um, you gonna pay for that? The world pay the world. My deeds have have paid have paid for have paid for for my food many times over. Okay. And the, the and the person behind the counter is like, "Hey, hey, that co- that cost it that cost eight silver. Hey, hey." Um. Oh, never mind. Uh, yeah. Um. Basically, this guy this guy's the big man. Okay. He is going to like. He's gonna rock you if you if you don't shut up. And I can I roll for intimidation? What? Uh, sure. <laughs> Sixteen. He rolled in that one. Uh, he looks, he looks oh, nice. He looks at he looks at he looks at he looks at you at you with a big angry face. Then then looks at, looks over at the ma- looks over at at the master who turns around with the turkey with the turkey legs sticking out his mouth. Looks back. Looks at, at. Looks at the master. Looks at you. Looks at the master. Looks at you. Says, "We look. It is a blessing to feed the hungry." <laughs> yes. Definitely. And uh, and the other people are in line behind. In line behind him, he just looks at him and goes, "We're close." <laughs> and he. Oh. Oh. And all the, all the pe- and all the people are like ah, oh. uh, but there, yeah, there there are signs of the of the carnival of the carnival getting ready to move. Uh, several of the several of the several of the of the shelves of the shelves in like the game the games area have already been cleared. Um, a lot of the and uh, and and you and uh, you notice that the big top is that there's not a show playing in it right now. Oh wow! Let's find Mr. Witch and Mr. Light. Okay, uh, you t- you take a walk. You, you you start walking walking around. Um, uh, roll a perception check. That's more reasonable. A natural twenty. An unnatural twenty. Uh, the two, the, the, about the time, about the time that you, uh, that, that you come around the corner and you see Mr. Witch and Mr. Light, uh, yelling at, yelling at each, uh, Mr. Mr. Uh, Mr. Witch is yelling, is yelling at Mr. Light about, about something or other. And about that time, the, the master walks up, walk, walks up, walks up behind you, uh, with a, uh, with a bag of popcorn that he got from somewhere. Um. <laughs> And uh, and Beisha and Beisha is with him and steps up behind you. Is that who we're looking for? Mm-hmm. Oh, well, I'm glad to see you're okay. Uh, I don't know. I you, tried. You found us. No, no, it, Beisha. I, I understand. Okay. It's 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 how he rolls. He's and, used to being in charge right. everywhere he goes. And he actually hasn't even put on the clothes he went in. Still in, he's still in the in the oh. long long white t-shirt thing. Yep. He says, "That's is that who we're looking for." Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hmm. I wave to Mister Witch and Mister Light. Both. They are both. They are both very in, in the. Involved in a very heated in a very heated discussion, um, they're not paying attention to pretty mu- to pretty much anyone. Oh, okay. Then I'll just eavesdrop. I like that. Uh, <coughs> Mr. W- Mr. Witch is Mr. Witch is saying, but our timetable says we must leave him. Says we have to leave as soon as possible. And and Mr. and and Mr. Light says, yes, but if you don't let the performers pack their things, they're gonna get really mad. But I don't. I they've known we were going to move for a week now. They've had plenty of notice. They could have been packing. 
then I'm not going to. We're not going to let a bu get let a bunch of cat let a a bunch of a, let a a bunch of two bit acts that I that I made that that I gave them names dictate my schedule for me. Yelling, but there's yelling and, and arguing about uh about uh logistics generally. Mm. Do they argue a lot? Mm. I ask. Yes, they do yeah, seem I to argue it's a lot. Part of their fun. Yeah. Okay. I go ahead and um bling up my my little light on my thing on my uh tiara, just uh turn it up a little bit. Okay. Um, and just sort of walk in the middle of it. Once I'm bored with what they're saying, basically. Okay. Uh, you you walk you walk right up to them and uh, they both they both they both notice they both notice you, uh, Mister Mister Light, Mister Mr. Light's face breaks into a big smile a big smile as he sees you and says. Oh look, there's one of the stars now. How are you, dear? No, oh. it's so good to see you. Welcome back. And Mr. and Mr. Mr. Witch just looks like, like, like he looks. He's impatient. He's a little, a little impatient. Like, like a another, another performer who's who's interrupting me and. Keeping my timetable up, but hmm. uh, but Mr. Light, Mr. Light is so happy to see you. What what can I do for you, dear? I'm so happy you're back. Well, um, you know, we just came to check in after being in Prismere, and if we can help get everybody packed up, maybe oh. we can make everybody happy. Yes, oh. Mr. Witch, we'd love to help. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry about him. He's just. He's just a fuss budget. Well, sometimes you need a fuss budget to get things done. Oh, that's true. He and I have been getting things done for have been getting things done for years now, haven't we, Mister Light? Or haven't we, Mister Mister Witch? Mister Witch is a, 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 a we don't need. I, I pay every I pay everyone well to do their jobs. They'd they'd better be they'd better be ready. And, uh, and I haven't budgeted for monarchs, for monarch assistance, so. That's okay. Um, we encountered some weirdness in Prismere. We thought we'd share the news. Well, at least I did. Um, so I tell in him, Prismere? You don't say. Yeah, no, a little bit different weird than the oh. usual weird. Oh. Okay, so. So I share the story of the um, the red cap that turned into a demon. Mister Mister Witch Mister Witch tur turns and, and is and is now focused intently on what. Okay, and the Blina is off. There's something really really wrong. They add. They, they share a look. They share a look together. I don't know what it is, but I would be very worried. Um, she almost seemed like she didn't remember what she'd done. Yeah, she killed her pilot. Yeah, Clabber, Clabberclaw. We put him back together and um, revived him, thanks to Veche. But she was talking about uh, asking whether we were loyal, things like that. Um, and then she appeared to not remember what she had done. You may want to block any people coming from Prismere to here or the Feywild at all through the mirrors, if you can. Well, I don't know if that's possible, but we just thought, thought we'd, you know, warn you that there's something very, very wrong well, thanks on that for the, side. Thanks for the warning, honey, but, but, uh, but you know, people come back and forth between here and Pris between here and Prismere all the time, and you know we we can't. I mean, if what if what you're talking about is true, I mean, there's so many people coming and going. I mean, they'd already be here, wouldn't they? Cyro, Cyro, 
Mr. 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 Witch says, no, there's there there've been no there've been no su no such in instances here. Customer service would have reported them to me. Hmm. Okay. But I'll go. But I'm. But I, I'm going to go find. I'm going to go find out what the what what the uh what the first aid what the first aid man can see. He he, he begins to he begins to 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 stomp to stomp off, and he's yeah and yelling at people as yelling at people he sees as he as he goes. Mister Light says, "I'd better go. I'd better go too. I've got to make got to make sure that the that the that they pack all their road cases correctly." It was good to see you. it was good to see you and congratulations on coming back and thanks again for everything you've done. Well, that's what a monarch does, right? Here. Go have a go have a drink on me and he then he and he uh and he to he tosses you uh tosses you four four gold coins uh with the imprint of the witch light carnival on them. Hmm. They're drink tokens. Okay. I um say thank you and I Keep the tokens, and um, I'm thinking about using my wish to protect this place. I know that's that's a lot, but if we do, if I do use the, a wish to protect this place, it means if we have the other key, we have a safe a safe zone to come to, and that's something. I'm not sure what's going on. Um, and I don't know if it'd be the wa a waste of a wish, but protecting the witch light and all who are on the witch light grounds would be you can use it if you want. I know, but I haven't thought it through yet, so do i do I notice your struggle of? This or is this something you're just talking? Well, about? I'm gonna say it out loud. I'm like I'm thinking about using the wish to protect this place, so we don't really know what's going on, and it'd be good to have a place to come back to that we know for sure is safe. Because I have a bad feeling that it isn't as safe as it could be. Right I, now, I I would say hold off. Okay. Because worst case scenario, we can fall back to the sanctuary, and where I come from. And it is fortified, and there's nothing getting into that place. Oh, and how are we going to get there? Is it far? Actually, we're going to have to ask the master because I got teleported here. Oh. I'm not sure where I'm at. Maybe Bayshan yeah. might be able to. We're all that. lost. I have. I, I'm just as lost as you guys are, maybe even oh. more. Roll of okay. perception. Yay. Each of you. Perception. Okay. Come on, good numbers. Good. Seventeen. Numbers. Yes, eighteen. Twenty-one. You look oh, around no. and you real you realize the master hasn't tipped anything in in a while. You look around and he's not standing with you anymore. Oh. You look about. You look about. Uh. You 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 spot him pretty quickly about uh about twenty feet away in front of a in front of a drink cart. Uh, and he's standing. He's standing there talking, talking with uh, with a high elven man, uh, his wife, and uh, and and uh, one of their children. Hey, well, okay. I, I'm gonna go get him. Um, I think we should go get him, and I'm gonna have to try to put him on some type of mental leash. I don't know what we're gonna do here. Uh, so I'm gonna run over real quick and kind of just slowly slide into the conversation with the master. Hey. What you doing? He's standing there, standing there, and, and, and he says, ah, "These are workers at the local university, not far, not far away from here. I, I've, I've, they've, they've been, uh, they've been filling me, they've been filling me in on, on, uh, on where we are." Oh, ah, uh, how, how Thank close you. are we to our um sanctuary? The totally wrong continent. Con con what yes. continent, sir? Yes, we're about we're about a, a third of the way around the orb from it, so to speak. Um. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Yes, and we we and we are far from your hive as well, young man. 
Although, although oh, your yeah. hive, your hive is is somewhat closer than uh, than our uh, than our stronghold. Mm. Unfortunately, we're also we're also we're also we're also inland. So there's so there's no way that, there's no way that we can avail ourselves of sea people transportation until uh, until we until that is uh, you know we until we hey, find the coast, master. The the these people here are they talking about the school of magic that's in Solaire? Uh, yes, yes, Solaire. That's it. The, the and and the gentleman the, and the gentleman says yes, yes, uh, yes. I'm a I'm a I'm a, a I'm a worker at the at at the university. I uh, I up op, I operate I operate one of the magical laboratories. And by and and my wife and my and my wife is a uh, is a professor of mathematics. I I I kind of put my arm around the master, and try to get gather up Nilla and kind of go away from either everyone's earshot. And just like, hey, come on, Beisha, come on, let's go this way. Look over here, this cool ride. Um, uh, the master says, "It's nice to meet you. Thank you very much." And uh, and allows him to him to be to be, uh, to be ushered around. And look, looks down, and says, "Good luck with your play, young lady." And uh, and gives a little. He's very polite. Gives a little gives a little wave and. Uh, and, and he is uh, until he wants to chop something apart. Um, and I once I get out, I can perceive myself getting out of earshot of everybody. I go, Master, guys, I was getting when I was getting looking for you, the school is where everyone thought you disappeared too. Oh, really? And that, that was well, my next place to go. Well, they thought they'd have information because they know about all kinds, they have a it's a knowledge base. Yeah. Yes. So I don't know. I don't know how come. Do we do we want to go there? Or <laughs> we don't even know what we're looking for at this point. Oh. You definitely, you definitely want to get some more clothes on. Well, the reason I'm thinking about going there is could it be a source of power or portals? Since it's a school of magic that might get us back to any of our own areas. Absolutely. All of these things, unless of course you want to run away with the circus. Where will the circus be going next? We can I... ask. I'll ask. I run off. Okay. Also, do I still have like my wing pack from uh yes. from before? Yes, you do. Oh. The wing pack, I'm probably not strong enough to carry um a tabaxi ranger and uh a sea <laughs> a sea person shape a, a shapeshifter, am I? No. Well, the the shapeshifter probably because the, the wing pack is a shapeshifter. Pack is, is only is only strong enough to carry you. Damn. Okay, that sucks. Uh, so Nilla, you go. So you go. You go running off. Where are you going running off to? Um, I want to find um, lost property, and I'm going to ask the displacer beast who is inclined to be nice to me. <laughs> I'm going going to say hello again. Do you know where the next stop is going to be? He says, "Oh yes, yes, we're we are go we are go we're going to travel acro ac across the the Sundering Sea, and we are go and we are going to and we are going to travel to uh going to travel to I think I think uh to Atlan. Okay, is that familiar to me at all? Do I know what she's talking uh, yes. about? Yes, yes, Atlan is is one of the is one of the great the, the the three great sea cities of the world. It's located. Mm -hmm. It's located in the middle of uh, it, at the at a skinny middle point between two huge con the two huge eastern continents, um, and uh, and is it's a it's it's a huge port of call. Um. Does it put it well at at the very least that can put us near the sea people. I don't know if they travel instantaneously or what. Um. But yeah. Okay. How long is it going to take us to get there? Uh. Well, you know, time is time is relative when when you travel when you travel through the Feywild. Ah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for the information. But and and I hear and I hear that 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 Zablina woke up too. So so it so it shouldn't be as dangerous to travel through as it has been recent as it has been recent. <clears throat> About that. Oh. I don't know about that. Keep your child close. Oh, 
and then I and then I uh, try and find Gray again. Gray in the group. Okay. As you're as you're uh, as you're walking, you're, as you're walking out, uh, there's the you you see the the last of the uh, the last of the tourists are are all leaving. Um, and and you see uh, and you see some tents are actually starting to get set up. Okay. So hey, you guys, I found out where we're going. It's a huge port of call. It's in the middle of everything. Um, at the very least, we can catch a ship to go wherever we want to go. I like it. Um, and travel is pretty quick when you're traveling with the witchlight, except. Well, we're probably going to be going through the Feywild real quick, just like for a second. Or a day. Or something. I got a bad feeling about this. Yeah, me too. But it's a short trip. Just We just left, you guys. I don't know. But it is, it does, it does cut time off the journey. Okay. So that's master, up to you guys. The master has has a slice has a slice of pie and a and a and a mug of ale. And where is he getting all his food? He's Golly. he's snatching it off of uh, off of place. If, off if, of place. If, if I if I notice anyone complaining about him not paying, I start throwing coin, <laughs> throwing coin to keep us on a low profile. Hmm. Uh, Whee! But he he looks up and says, "Well, they're closing. We need to leave." Nope. We can either um. You can either stay with the witch light and travel with them or and go to that main port of call um but we'll go through the fail wilds to get there or we could leave I, i'm not sure so, if going back to the Fey, if going back to the fail wild is, is really the, the best idea right now I, 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 I'm not feeling the Feywild. I don't know about you. Um, okay, we'll take the long way around. Yeah, I think I think we should take the long way around. Hmm. Perhaps we should. Uh, perhaps we, we should. Perhaps. Uh, perhaps we, we should. Uh, we should exit in haste as well, uh, before we, before we get conscripted into uh, into helping with this. And he be and he turns and begin and begins. Uh, Begins, you know, his show slow shuffle walk, uh, out the out the main the out the main entrance, which is which uh which there's which there's a, a couple of guys a couple of workers, uh that are that are in, in the process of uh, of striking. Wait, so we're not going to Atlan? Because he just left. Well, we're we're not going back to the Feywilds. Which means we're not gonna follow the carnival. Nope. Apparently okay. Not, nope. He he just he just rolled out. Up and left. Yeah. yeah he's, he, the, the master is noping out about the Feywild. So. Okay. Uh, you can you can stop and and uh, and change his mind if you wish. Sure. Um, I have a. I don't I, care. Journey's a journey. Um. Uh. Yeah. I'll try to change his mind. Okay. Uh. With uh. What should I use? Which Which charisma thing should I use here? I I, I have three ones: persuasion, deception, and intimidation. I don't think intimidation is gonna work. I don't think deception is gonna work. Persuasion, probably persuasion. Okay. It's your argument. Yeah. So I'm gonna roll persuasion. I'm gonna try and. Uh. Artificial, uh, artificial twenty. Really? Yes, I rolled a fifteen, and okay. my charisma is plus five, so artificial twenty. Make your, uh, make your argument. So he, he's, he's still, he's still walking. All right, come on, man. It's gonna be like maybe not even like a couple hours. Like we're in the Feywilds for, we're, we're. It's gonna, it's gonna be for a little while, you know. Uh, and we're gonna be, we're gonna reach our location soon. And Atlan is a big, bustling city, which means there's going to be all the types of food. Like, so, so many types that you can just, like, feast upon, right? You know? This food is wonderful. Food is wonderful, young, young one. However, how, however, 
I'm not sure how much time you spent in the Feywild, but but uh, but they they say they say oh this will just be a minute and then forty years later you walk out. Yeah, but like if this your, time, oh, if your if your mission is time is time critical, young one, I highly suggest I highly suggest you do not go where time is variable. That's a good point. He's got it. He's got a point there. He's got a point there. <laughs> he's got a point. He, he we also, could come back and it'd be already done. <laughs> he also rolled a twenty-three. So, oh, that's why. So he's very but, convincing. Yes. So you're, you're. He says your argument is good. Your argument is sound. However, however, in my in my exper in my experience, not only are the not only uh, are mechanically. Is the Feywild not a good, not a good option for us due to due to the strangeness of time here, but the but the Fey themselves the Fey themselves are notoriously capricious. All right. So, uh, what's your plan then? I plan on oh. walking down this on on walking down this road and finding finding where it takes me, which I believe is to okay a, to a local university. It's not like the world is ending or anything. Certainly. But it takes the time that it takes, does it not? Mm-hmm. And he keeps on walking. Okay. Thankfully, he's he's pretty short. He's kind of old, so he's a little... Uh... Yeah. Uh, are you... Fo is everyone else following him? Sure. Yeah, I mean, yeah. like, he's pretty important, so why would... I mean, I don't know why I would, ab why I would abandon him. We've got to get you a change of clothes, though. Nah, he's all right. I am comfortable. At least a belt. Presentation is everything. Look at me. I don't look at me. I don't need clothes. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Exactly. To, to the to the to the to the young bug you listen. <laughs> he's he, and and uh, you, as as you as you you're walking as you. You round the round the kind of like the, the entrance area. Uh, you see that there is a uh, there is a, a small wagon. You okay. You good? I need to get something to drink. Okay. Sorry. Uh, shall we take Shall we take a quick five? Yes. Yep. Five. Alrighty. Uh, the recording is.